Hey, what's up YouTube? All right, this is vlog like 136 of my channel and I wanted to go over the basics, the basics of how to dress when you're kayak fishing. So here we go. In the next few minutes, I'm going to go over what is important to wear when you go out on the water for a long period of time. Alright, so here's all the uh, clothing that I usually use when I go out. I got my gloves, alright, just some mechanics gloves from Harbor Freight. I got a crazy sun hat, long bill, and neck protectant, which I would normally just wear in my boonie cap, but um, I don't have my boonie cap, it's in the truck, so that's gone. Got the neck protector right here. And it is the thin sunshade type uh, cloth. Um, it's basically just a really thin. These are made by Mojo. Got them in a fishing tournament. And then these are my sun pants, right? By PFG Columbia um, clothes. Got the bathing suit net. And um, they come apart at the legs here where you can unzip and make these into shorts. Or you can have long pants which makes them really nice to use. You got to protect yourself from the sun. I do this in a lot of different ways. One, with a hat, with a face mask, and with shirts and pants, okay? Um, even when you wear sunscreen, the, the sun is absolutely brutal. The water washes it off of you, and you're going to get bar bombarded by the sun for six, seven hours. So we got to take this into account, and we got to make ourselves, one, accountable to ourselves, to wear it and two to make sure we have these things these things in our kit bag when we have them in our kit bag we can always pull them out and wear them now when I go out if I'm going out like BTB in the mornings and I'm leaving at like six or seven in the morning I'm gonna wear a sunproof shirt like this these are like this is one of those moisture wicking like sunshade shirts they're made by this one's made by H2O I got it at Walmart for like ten bucks after the year was over, which I pick them up sometimes like that. I think they're like the, the UPF type stuff, like the Omni Shade type material. Um, this is a PFG hat, okay? It's the same type of material. Basically, I, I wear my Under Armour stuff, the, the ones that are real close to the skin, because once you get them wet, they, um, they're not hot and they protect you from the sun. Um, you know, these are like usually like the same as wearing like 50 sunscreen. And you'll get sun through them, but it'll be less sun, and they're not real hot to wear. Uh, you still got you need to drink a lot of water, but um, if you get too hot, you can just pour some water on top of you. It cools it down, and then the wind hits you and cools you down. All right, so I want to get into the other pieces that I got here. All right, the next most important piece of clothing when you're out there all day is get you a pair of these pants. These are the uh, PFG pants, okay? These are by Performance Fishing Gear, and they're made out, well, Columbia PFG, and they're made out of like an Omni Shade material. Let's see if I can find the patch here. Anyways, just a pair of pants, and see these right here, they, uh, the legs zip, okay, and you can take these off and make them in shorts, okay, they've got a zipper on them right here. And you just unzip them, and now they're a pair of shorts, like a swimming suit, but you can also put the legs back on them. Now, this, these things are uh, the same way. You'll get, like, I don't know, like 50, like, you, like just like 50 sunscreen, okay? And they will protect your, your legs for most of the day. But don't get me wrong. You can still get sunburned through this. I've gotten light sunburns through this shirt being out there all day but it will definitely protect you for like 95 percent of the day in the most intense sunlight ever okay so all right just remember a pair of you know breathable sun pants these are by oh here's the omni shade see this omni shade material they've got the little breathable vents and it's got a bathing suit lining and um, a drawstring so i got these at academy and 
they're great. I got one pair, probably need two for the, if you fish a lot, keep them clean, rinse them out, and these have last, held up really well. I'm actually coming out with a lineup. I'm actually going to make some Yak Motley shirts and probably some of these pants too. So if you're interested in those, hit me up. The website will probably be launching soon. So yeah, these were like 30 bucks. Get a pair. Next, I want to go over gloves, okay? So if your, your, your top's covered up and your legs are covered up and you're wanting to be out there all day, your hands need to be covered up. These are just a pair of Western uh, American, or Western safety, Western safety gloves, okay? And these I bought at Harbor Freight for like $2.99. Okay, you can get mega sales for these. And um, they're great for grabbing fish, putting fish on hooks. And if you're out there with sabiki rigs or any type of whatever, it keeps hooks out of your fingers. And if you got to thumb that spool or whatever, your fingers are protected. Or handle braided line, your hands are a little more protected. And it keeps the sun off of them. So you don't want burnt hands, because burnt hands are no good. All right, the next piece of really important stuff that you need, a neck face cover, okay? This goes in your face just like this, all right? It's like the, at the 50 sun, sun protectant right here, and it keeps the glare from the water off of your face. So as it reflects up underneath your hat, it will burn your face and it will be miserable. This, uh, you can breathe through it, it's not real thick. You can also just bring it down like this or however you wanna do it. And your face is protected. A lot less area you gotta put sunscreen on. All right, moving right along. Some people like to have the big hats, okay? This is the way Rob rocks, rocks it. If you see him out there in his little weird looking hat, this is what it is. It's got the side protectant, the neck's protectant, the long bill, or bill and uh, it really cuts the glare down in the water. Really awesome. Couple that with this, you look something like you look something like this, and you're protected. All right. Or you can look something like this. So, um, FYI, on the fishing clothing. All right. Ready? Yeah, that's most of the clothing that I wear when I go out, and I usually put sunscreen on my feet unless you've got water shoes and you're protected for most of the day. So if you got any questions on this stuff, just shoot it to me, right? Check out the Academy lineup. I'm gonna be coming out with my own fishing shirts and stuff. You know, get you, a, get, get you one of those neck things, get you some gloves, get you some good sun protective clothing, and you'll be set and you can fish every day instead of getting sunburned and having to stay out of the sun for a long time. It's really important to make sure that you're using the right sun to protect it, and that way you can go out and have more fun. So if you like this video, please like and subscribe. Shoot me on Facebook on Yak Motley and Instagram and all that, and I'll see you guys next time later.